The implantation does not take place immediately after the embryo transfer. What we do in an embryo transfer is that we generally release the embryo inside of the cavity uh, using a medium specially designed for keeping the embryo alive and then the embryo remains there for between 24 to 36 hours when the real implantation takes place. It's around between day 6, day 7 after the egg collection. Um, it's quite common that patients ask us what they can do after the embryo transfer because they just try to improve or make it easier for the embryo to facilitate the implantation. In fact, there is nothing patients can do. And as I always say, I give the example of a woman who gets pregnant naturally and well, these uh, women do not usually do anything special. They just live completely normal life and they don't stay at home. They don't stop doing things. They go to the gym. They have their glass of wine whenever they want or things like that. So don't get too stressed. Uh, the embryos are not going to fall out. Even if you go to the loo right after the transfer, even if you move or even if you take a plane and you fly back to your home. So this, uh, the, the, the endometrium cavity is a virtual cavity and the embryos remain there until they implant or not.